Aurora Lee, first book, by Elizabeth Barrett Browning. Of writing many books, there is no end. And I, who have written much in prose and verse for others' uses, will write now for mine. Will write my story for my better self, as when you paint your portrait for a friend who keeps it in a drawer and looks at it long after he has ceased to love you, just to hold together what he was and is. I, writing thus, am still what men call young. I have not so far left the coasts of life to travel inland that I cannot hear that murmur of the outer infinite. Which unweaned babies smile at in their sleep, when wondered at for smiling not so far. But still, I catch my mother at her post beside the nursery door, with finger up, hush, hush. There's too much noise, while her sweet eyes leap forward, taking part against her word in the child's riot. Still, I sit and feel my father's slow hand. When she had left us both, stroke out my childish curls across his knee, and hear a Santa's daily jest. She knew he liked it better than a better jest. Inquire how many golden scudi went to make such ringlets. Oh, my father's hand stroke heavily, heavily the poor hair down. Draw, press the child's head closer to thy knee. I'm still too young, too young to sit alone. I write. My mother was a Florentine whose rare blue eyes were shut from seeing me when scarcely I was four years old. My life, a poor spark snatched up from a failing lamp, which went out. Therefore, she was weak and frail. She could not bear the joy of giving life. The mother's rapture slew her. If her kiss had left a longer wait upon my lips, it might have steadied the uneasy breath and reconciled and fraternized my soul with a new order. As it was, indeed, I felt a mother want about the world, and still went seeking, like a bleeding lamb left out at night in shutting up the fold, as restless as a nest deserted bird grown chill through something being away. The what? It knows not. Thank mm-hmm. you.